Hello again, everybody. Welcome back to Harry's House of Hits. We got another HGA reveal today. This is our, what do we see, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10th cards from HGA coming in here. Five hot cards. You might remember my buddy sent off an order, and HGA lost his cards. They didn't know where they went. He got panicking, and he sent them a message, and they were real awesome about it. And they said, hey, don't worry about it. We'll refund your money. Send five more cards for free. And he did. Got those five back. Well, guess what? They found those other five cards, and they didn't ask for more money. They just sent them back because they're great guys over at HGA. I think good things are happening over there. So we got the box. But before we get into this box, i got to point out the two boxes on the screen. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to drop Harry for a second because i got to tell you. This is uh, our two boxes we're going to break. Two Hobby Boxes Stadium Club. Two autographs in each box. Each box. And uh, we have lowered the price from $40 per lot to $25 per lot. Go to our Facebook page to see what the lots consist of. There's three teams per lot. You can pick and choose which lot you want. $25 shipped. Okay, You can't beat that. We're talking about not even making a dime on this deal. Uh, we are going to ship them out to you, so uh, hit it while it's hot. We've already sold two more since, I mean, it's been 30 minutes since we changed the price down to 25. We've already sold two more lots, so it's going to go fast. So get on, get in there, and be a part of this break. And we're going to break it as soon as it sells out. My hope is to do it on Wednesday night because, uh, well, I just want to get it done on Wednesday night because i got to start packing for Disney. Yeah. I'm going to go see the mouse. Okay, we're going to go check out the mouse here in a little bit. So, anyways, with that said... Get in that break. Check us out on Harry's House Fits on Facebook to be a part of it. All right. Now that I've talked about the Top Stadium Club 2021 break, I want to point out the artwork in front of you. Harry's House of Hits is brought to you by Sean Thornson. Thank you very much, sir. All right. My buddy's ready to go. We're fired up about this because there are some really cool cards in here that I know he was pretty bummed about when they lost them, but they found them and they sent them to him. Um, they probably could have pocketed these, and you never know. They never even said a word. All of a sudden, I got a shipping notice. Like, boom. So, here they come. Yep, so, they HGA, um, I'll tell you this. I'm getting emails from PSA, and, like, their company guys are just dropping like flies. Like, their people are resigning. I, I'm nervous. I got a whole, I got a huge... Man, how many cards do we send? 20? We got a lot. 20, we 20, 25 clubs. cards. We've got an order without me, and we've got an order together. Yeah, that's true. There's a whole bunch of cards at PSA, and we're waiting for those cards to come back. They and they moved an inch. They've been on Station 3 forever and ever. I got to reading, and it says that at the Q, was it the Q? Uh, I can't remember. There's one stage where you're supposed to pay, but I'm, I'm hoping... Uh, that we, we aren't sitting in that stage because I was trying to read up on it, but I don't think that's the case. I think they're stuck where they're at. Um, hopefully, we figure it out sooner or later. I don't think you pay until the end of them. Yeah, so it should be the very we're end. We're a long way from the end. Correct. All right, so last, there's the box, empty box now. Yep. Um, so what we're going to do, last time we did this, I got something sticking to me here. It's, uh, I don't know what it is. I'm going to get rid of it. So it's freak, little disclaimer, it's this freaking was me a... Out. Uh, this was a kind of a test shot on some of these cards to see what HGA could do. Um, they were brand new. I got in one of their first submissions ever when I sent these in. And I know a little bit more about grading now than I did then. And you know what? If they're nines or nine fives, I'll be smiling all day long. Yeah. Yeah. So you're just hoping for good grades? No, no eight and a half. <laughs> We're gonna we're gonna hope for no eight and a half. We're gonna use trout here to cover up the HGA reveal. How's that, huh? We're gonna use trout on the Heritage 2019 uh, low series. We made that mistake. You want the high series in this, guys? If you buy this, get the high series. There, although there's a cool Juan Soto card in there. That's true. There is. We didn't get it, but there is. I one. did get it. You got it? Yeah, oh. my dog ate it. Oh, that's right. I forgot about your dog eating that card. Okay, HGA reveal first card is a Ronald Acuna Jr. from the Update Series. Is this rookie card? Rookie debut. Rookie debut. And here it is. A 9.5 Ronald Acuna Jr. rookie debut. How about that? That's sweet. I like the color on it, too. I is love that the, all 9.5 subgrades? All 9.5 subgrades. That's the corners, the surfacing. I don't know if you guys can see I that if that I get a little closer. Oh, my camera doesn't want to focus in real good there, but... Hey, that's what it is. Centering surface, edges, and center. 
corners, surface, edges, and centering. Sorry about that. That's a beautiful card, man. It is. For an Acuna fan, that's not going anywhere. Absolutely. Anyway, so. And I love the fact they come bagged already. It's yeah. nice. So, anywho, there's that one. Okay. Um, let's 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 line them up. See if it'll see if that'll hold. I don't know if it'll nine or not. five. I, nine I'm five. impressed on that one. Yep. Like that's I said, I, good. I didn't know as much about grading when I sent these off as I do now. I think the nine I've learned a little bit. Nine five is pretty comparable to the uh, Beckett nine five. Am yeah. I right? Yeah. I, Maybe yeah. a PSA to, ten more like. To compare these to PSA is tough. Yeah. I, I would throw them in with Beckett and SGC. Yeah. All right. Card number two. Ah, uh, we're gonna save that one. I don't want to see that one yet. That's a that's a special card. Hopefully you couldn't see what it was on YouTube. But the next card is, this is a Randy O. Rose Arena U three five. I believe this that's is a chrome card in chrome the version. Day. Look at that, a nine point nice. oh mint. That's the corners are nine, surface is nine, edges are nine, and centering is nine point five. Well, Out of all these, have we seen a 10 on anything yet? No 10 subgrades No yet. 10 subgrades yet. whatsoever. I, they, they do give them out, but... I think it's pretty hard to get one. That's why That's why I like comparing them to Beckett, um, because you get a 10 in Beckett. It's like yeah. finding a unicorn. Yeah. Um, but you, you'll you get 10 subgrades, just it's hard to find the 10 overall. Right. But, anyway, there you Still go. a nice card. That's a sweet card. Randy Rose Arena. Next up... Let's see if we can keep that on the screen. Next up... Here we go. Oh, this is this is one you like. That's Prime old, times that's two. This is a Braves fan special here. Tough Let's see what we got. Here. Hey, a nine, nine point on oh, and they went with the Falcons colors. Sweet. That's pretty cool. Oh, we got a ten on centering. Hey, how about that? Look at that. On a, ni- on a, on a 1992 nine. card. Yeah. See, so there's centering. the card, folks. That's a pretty awesome card. It's got the Braves twice and then the inaction Falcons cover. How about but, uh, that? The corners are an 8.5. Well, it's a 1992. It, not a lot of those cards survived greatly. I I don't see an 8.5 on the corners, but I'm not going to argue with there. I'm going to do something, guys. Hang with me here. I've got my I've got my light here. I've got to see these corners. Ah. Uh, Man, I don't know about that. Those corners. Maybe looking at the backside, this corner up here looks just a little bit iffy. And you'll be able to see it a little better, Ryan, when you take a good close look at it. Maybe. Those upper decks but, are tough, though. And 8.5, that's that's rough. That's, that's rough. Cause, still, still a 9. Well, your Surface got an 8. Uh, I'm not surprised out of that year. The scratches and things like yeah, that, yeah. yeah. They were but they were just different back then. The centering though pulled the grade up, like yeah. cra- like gangbusters. Nice job there. Yeah. So, anyways, that's a Still sweet a card. Cool card. I don't know that that card it matters what it's valued. It's probably going in my collection. Oh, you're not getting rid of that. I've got another one, as a matter of fact, that's still wrong. Mm-hmm. So. Yep. All right, here we go. Card number four. Brr, this is the one. The Fernando Tatis Jr. Rookie card. Series two I'd from make a 2019. Bold What's that? I would say nine. You're taking a I nine on this seen one. Very many good grades coming out of these. If this and is it's all because of the edges. Yeah, I get that because they're just a little furry. This is a nine. It's a yep. nine. God, I like that color. That's sweet. Yep. Man, that is an I awesome like it card. Too. Like I said, I'm not disappointed, but that seems to be the trend with those. Nines across the board. All the way. Nines across the board. I'd like to know what a 10 centering looks like, because I'm dying to know where that glove's at perfectly. Yeah. Because PSA, it kind of floats around. I think my other one was a 9.5 centering, and this one is closer to the edge. Yeah. So... There. So you have two rookies that are graded? By HGA. Yes. Wow, nice. And then you also have a raw one, don't you? That we're trying to work out a deal with you. Right. i got to have it for my 2019 set. That's sweet. That is awesome. Nice card right there. Evidently, so, I like landscape cards. Gee whiz. Yeah, you sent you sent uh, two of them in. But three, this one... Three of them there. Yeah, three of them there, yeah. This one is not a landscape card, if I'm not mistaken. It is not. Not a landscape card, and I'm dying to see what this is. Because I, I would risk to say this isn't going to be a high grade, but it's going in a PC anyway. So. Tiger Woods. Second year. Second year card. 8.5 upper deck. You can see the sand coming up from his bunker shot here. So the edges, it says 7.5. That's what got you on this Ooh, one. That's rough. 
on those. Mm -hmm. I sure didn't see that, but nope. like I said, it's hard for me to argue. Well, that's why you sent them somebody else to grade them. I mean, and they do it. Uh, they do a good job. But that's, I mean, that's an awesome card. I still, I don't care. Tiger Woods, um, graded, HGA, 8.5. I like how they splash match the green. Yeah, that's pretty awesome, too. It's kind of the green matches what's down here. That's a really beautiful card. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm going to tell you, as it stands right now, that's, I don't know, it's hard for me to go against the Fernando Tatis Jr. I, he is such an unbelievable player, and it is as a rookie card. Acuna, this is a pretty card, too, because of the coloring and the yeah. label. I love that. But I think this is my favorite card, the Tiger Woods. That's pretty cool. Only golf card I own that is graded. Yeah. I do have a tin that has his collection mm -hmm. in it. But. I tell you what, it's making me want to get on and try to try to get, get cards Well, they just announced they're going to take 17,000 submissions this week. So. Wow. It's pretty good. Now's the time to give them some business. Yeah, if get they, in there and hope for the best. I know a lot of people are timid, but if they mess up, trust me, folks, they'll make it right. Oh, yeah. There's yeah. proof right there. They take care they of you. They could have taken these cards and yep. wisdom in the trash, and I would have been none the wiser. So we're working out a trade. I got a couple Jacob DeGrom rookie cards here. You think my buddy's going to send them off to get graded at HGA? Something tells well, me. Well, I can't send them off to PSA. Something tells me that he will if he trades them to me. Of course, I'd show you what I'm getting in there, but I really don't want you to know what I'm getting out of this deal. <laughs> I don't even want to hear your opinion on it. So this we're going to deal off, but those would be cool if they were graded. Get the, the orange and blue border, like this the team border on this. That'd be fantastic. That'd be sweet. Yeah. But anywho. What I'd love to do, and they've announced they're going to up their custom labels, but it'd be cool if they did like a Mets logo background in the label. Oh, yeah. They'd have to have some sort of deal with a Major League Baseball to do that. Mr. Baseball or something yeah. in the back. That right, way. yeah, that'd be cool. But I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, so we there's... we got to make the deal happen first. Yeah, we, yeah, we got work. We got work to do still because uh, I'm struggling with it because the way this went down, I'll just tell you, the way this went down is we were in Branson, and I think I've already said this on, on the channel, and if I'm repeating myself, then just bear with me. I'm getting old. Um... I went, we went to Branson. Ryan and I went to Branson with our wives. Had a great time. Went into an antique mall. And I found in one of the booths at Branson a shelving unit that had sets that were already in binders. And I found a 2014 Tops set for 30 bucks. Yep. 30 bucks. Okay. It had Series 1 and Series 2 complete 2014. And then I got to the back, and the back had. Some, not all, of the update series. And these two cards were in there. 30 bucks I spent on these two cards and the entire 2014 set. I got a steal. I'm telling you, that's probably what I should be doing on this channel, is taking the camera around to antique malls and finding stuff. Because I think that'd be fun. Uh, yeah. Because finding that one, I mean, that was a gem. We got, I got... I walked right past it. Yeah, that's true. Because he was looking for boxes, and I happened to find binders. It was like binders, like it was a bunch of them. But I found these. I also found a 2014 Series 1 orange Mike Trout numbered to 199. The orange Mike Trout, number to 199, also has um, Miggy on it, as well as Joe Maurer. I've got it on eBay right now for 99.99. I have no clue what it's worth because no one else has shown. I, I can't find it. So what a steal that was for 30 bucks to get the set, which is what all I wanted. And I got these two cards and that Trout is fantastic. Also got a Giancarlo Stanton out of 199 orange too. So. Anyway, you didn't get hurt on that one. No, I, I did. I did just fine. I did good on that deal. But anyways, we're working out a deal for those Degroms. Um, I'm sure he'll send them off to HGA and get them graded, and they'll be beautiful, and I'll be jealous. <laughs> but I've got some other stuff in the work. I'm doing some investing with him. So, anywho. Anyway, and just another shout out again. I doubt they pay attention to stuff like this, but maybe they do. Um, just to give them a little shout out, they they more than made this deal right. Um, these cards were lost in limbo for three months and all of a sudden show up on my doorstep. So, yeah, um, they're a young company, folks. To expect them not to make a mistake, that's they're going to make mistakes. Everybody I makes mistakes. I guarantee a PSA makes them. Um, 
So just know that all you have to do is ask or bring it to their attention, and they're going to make it right. Absolutely. They'll do what they can. And they with this, sending these, they went over the top. These mm-hmm. could have went in the trash can. They could have went. We already paid them. Yeah. So. Yep. They could have not graded them. Right. Here's and, your cards back, but yeah, sorry. So great job, HGA. Um, if I am, to, if I get anything graded, that's who I'm going to try to get through. Um, I'm not much on grading right now because I am a set and building machine. Um, and one of these days, I will show you how many sets I have. Um, I started with nothing, and I probably have. 40 now, 40 but different that's a, sets. That's a time for a longer video. That is a lo- much longer video. So, <laughs> thanks for jo- joining us tonight. We've got 80 subscribers. We've decided we're going to give our next giveaway at 100 because we're looking to get 100. We, we're going to do 75, but um, it took us a long time to get there. So we're just going to wait for 100. Once we get to 100, we'll have a pretty big giveaway. Uh, we may we may just give away several different cards or something like that. I don't yeah, know. We'll, we'll figure out. But um, hit that subscribe button. Or like yeah, that. yeah, that'd be or cool. Whatever we can find. Yep. So um, don't forget. I'm gonna move these out of the way because we have a break. Twenty-five dollars a lot. You get three teams in the lot. We balanced them. Um, we tried to evenly balance the lots out. Um, I haven't seen anybody. I've got another Facebook notification. I may have sold another one. So you better get on it. You better get on it. Get on it quick uh, before we sell out. Twenty-five dollars a lot. Harry's house fits on Facebook. One more thing real quick. What was it? What was I going to think? I was going to say something, but I think I forgot what I was going to say, so I'm just going to say goodbye. Another one has sold. So. Another one has sold. Another one. Another one. All right. So get it quick. Get it while it's hot. $25. So we're halfway there, aren't we now? We got five? That'd make five, right? Uh, that is one, two, three, four, five, six. Six sold. Six out of ten. There's only four left. Get it while it's hot. I'd love to break it tomorrow night. That'd be cool. Yep. Of course, I guess you're busy tomorrow night. Maybe tomorrow night I'm busy, yeah. but that doesn't mean you can't break well, it. Well, that's true. I could break it. We could do it live. We will go live on YouTube to break that. So, anywho, without further ado, that's all we got from here tonight. Um, I actually am going to record this video right next, right afterwards. I bought a mega box of Top Series 2, and I can't wait. I can't wait. Let's get into that. So, we're going to do that right after I get done pushing the button here to finish this video off. So... Have a great night from Harry's House of Hits. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, like it, all that good stuff that people beg you to do when you're watching their YouTube videos. But for Harry's House of Hits, Cubs win! Cubs win! Cubs win!